What do you think they've got in? Welcome to the Rizzo's Purple Berry Purple Hedges treatment. Grown on top of Industrial Sludge Pit 27C, these unusually tall purple berry trees have grown lush, luxuriant foliage and are literally bursting with extra specially piquant purple berries. As you wander through our winding maze, feel free to try a fresh purple berry right from a branch. Maybe you'll discover our next new flavor. Limit one berry per customer. Do not try any purple berries outside of the puzzle hedges. Some visitors have speculated as to the presence of a treasure at the end of the maze. While Rizzo's has placed nothing like this in the puzzle hedges, we still encourage you to explore to your heart's content. Should you experience dizziness, faintness, or simply get lost among the hedgerows during your exploration, please do not try to contact Rizzo's personnel. Simply shelter in place and rescue will arrive within 72 hours, guaranteed. Accepting unplanned shutdowns at any other time seems inconvenient by management. I've already told you six times, and I'll tell you six more. I don't want a fucking tour! You can badger me all you want. I don't care if I'm from Forest Mills. I'm here as an individual, and I have just as much right to be here as any other visitor. You're welcome to bring a lawyer if you really want to try to force me out, but I can guarantee you that I will bury them. Laws alive? Rizzo's has finally sent their strong armors, I see. Wait a moment. You have all your teeth. You're not soaked in filth, and you don't look quite as slack-jawed as the regular Rizzo's staff. Are you not with Rizzo's? Between the lockdown and the fiasco at the Grand Colonial, there are more interesting places for the average colonist to be. Which leads me to believe you're no average colonist. Regardless, please inform me if you'd be interested in a job. I've spent enough time out here that I'm starting to itch. I do not enjoy itching. I'm sure you have questions. I do indeed. Specifically, I'm their general counsel. Forest Mills, if you somehow don't know, owns Tile, Wentworth, Dock Rocket, and 24-7 Furniture. Were something of a big deal. When the going gets tough, the lawyers start going. Some farther than others. I've been a junior lawyer for coming up on 20 years now. And quite frankly, I'm getting old. Hopefully, there will be enough legal kindling out here to fuel my firm for a while longer. And if I find that kindling, I stand to finally get my raise. I did. You see, Rizzo's has been advertising a contest in the Puzzle Hedges. Whoever gets to the center first gets a bottle of the first Spectrum ever made, the Spectrum Original. My interest, however, lies with the associated promise the chance to attend the Spectrum Brown unveiling and meet Halcyon Helen. Indeed, you are a savvy one. Rizzo's can no longer make good on their promise, which means this entire contest is one big fraud case. All I need is a single piece of evidence. With the Spectrum original bottle, which is located in the center of the puzzle hedges, I will have all I need to sue Rizzles for all they're worth. That's where you come in. Two buffoons, but persistent buffoons. There's that woman from Glacial Age who has perhaps never had an original idea in her life and hopes to pass the original off as her own. Then there's Navare, who is strange. I suggested I give her the original after my lawsuit if we work together, but she wouldn't hear of it. It must be hers alone, it seems. Navigating the maze is normally no easy task, Rizzo's has no interest in giving their property, however old, away for free. No easy task, huh? We'll just see about that. I'm glad you're feeling confident, but this maze is deadly by design. 
And if that weren't enough, Zimmerman and Navarre don't want anyone sneaking away with their prize. The place is mined and rife with murderous mechanicals. Technically, I sue not on behalf of Forest Mills, but for my own benefit. In arbitration, it might be difficult to argue that this contest is designed to slight Forest Mills. However, as it so happens, if my lawsuit takes a chunk out of their savings, then I can collect while also damaging their capital. It's a mutual win. I make millions, Rizzo's falls further from the board's good graces, and Forest Mills products look that much more valuable compared to Rizzo's trash. I don't know if you know this, but Rizzo's is on the outs. They're losing power and losing money. This was no doubt a desperate bid to regain some lost clout. That, or their marketing team, is particularly spiteful. You know the saying, I'm sure. Why work for a promotion when sabotage takes half the time and a quarter of the effort? <laughs> Excellent! I look forward to finally being able to focus solely on legal matters. Oh, and keep an eye out for competitors. Odds are they'll be looking out for the original as well. My word, stranger, you sure gave me a fright. I thought you were one of those strange sorts heaving all over the place. Maybe they got a bad batch of purpleberry wine. Since you don't seem to be laughing maniacally or projectile vomiting, think you could do me a favor? I'm trying to come up with a new name for a glacial age product, but the creative side of things just isn't my area of expertise. Do you happen to have any ideas? Wow, a real consultant. And I had the good fortune for you to luck into me. I'd be delighted to pay you. So, the company I'm with is Glacial Age. Our products usually have a finer ring to them, and the product I'm trying to name is a vodka. Take your shot. Sounds great! I'm sure my bosses will love it. And don't worry, I'll absolutely credit you in one of the product footnotes. Oh, nothing all that fantastical. Just a new product idea Glacial Age R&D is working on. Uh, an idea that has nothing to do with why I'm in the puzzle hedges. <laughs> But as it so happens, I'm a little on the lost side, so thinking about it helps keep the panic at bay. If you find a map or a stepladder or something, don't hesitate to let me know. I'm beginning to fear coming here wasn't worth the trouble. Close. I want what's in the center. You've heard of the competition, right? Whoever gets to the center gets a rare Rizzo's product and the chance to meet Halcy and Helen? My eyes on the rare Rizzo's product, namely the Spectrum Original, the first product Rizzo's ever made. I intend to reverse engineer it and make it Glacial Age's own. Taking someone else's old thing and repackaging it as your new thing? Classic Byzantium. Ooh, this is dandy. I was not expecting any feedback from field testing before I'd even created the product. I'll be sure to jot that down for future reference. All I need for my prototype is the original itself. Then I can start production. Dishonest. I've only ever heard that word used in that arbitration serial, Lawful Label. Rizzo steals, Spacer's Choice steals, Auntie Cleo steals. 
And so, if Rizzo's decides to release one of their original products for anyone to take, then it's Glacial Age's right to swoop in and be proactive. Reckon not. I've seen a couple of folks as out of place as... Well, me. One's a lawyer. You can tell by the smell of cigarettes, booze, and tears. Must sense there's a lawsuit to be found with the original. On principle, I don't want him to get it. Also ran into a woman with a funny look in her eye. Plain told me she wanted the prize so she could stick it on a shelf. Hell's the use in that. Shelf ain't gonna help nobody. Looks like the others are getting a little more aggressive. I know it's asking a lot, but maybe you could find it for me instead? Help out a struggling R&D developer? My oh my, wouldn't it be wonderful if a freelancer could help rescue me from my horrible plight?
system and... Clearing cues security action. Everyone all right? Greetings. Have you brought your auto mechanical to the service technician lately? Respectfully, I think there are better places to try to sell things than the middle of a hedge maze. Judging by this exchange, I presume you are not the person I was waiting here to meet. You're not covered in a layer of dirt, fertilizer, and self-loathing. Listen, I don't know you, so I'd rather keep my admissions to a minimum without the presence of legal counsel. I was waiting for someone to give me information about these hedges. That's as much as you need to know. Why do people who are hiding something always have so much to say about it? I take offense to that. I think. Shh! Not so loud! Ah, damn it. I guess you already know. I am indeed looking for the prize. You've caught me. you now. And how do you know the others aren't secretly Rizzo's agents, who will stab you in the back and take the bottle the moment you turn away? Give me the original and your actions will actually matter. I can promise you that. What interest have I in an unveiling? I don't watch much in the way of serials, and crowds only make it easier for people to get behind you. I'm after the Spectrum original itself. And not to drink. Have you noticed that there's no trace of anything the corporations have done in the past? 
In fact, this contest for the original is the only time I've ever seen a corp refer to a prototype product not currently on the market. And why isn't it on the market? Hardly. If the Corp really cared so much, they wouldn't throw their old products out so readily. All I am is a collector. Whatever people choose to think of my collection is their problem, not mine. Think fast. Never know when someone will come out of a bush, bolt or pistol at the ready. Keep your voice down. Never know who might be listening. Unexpected noise identified. Security patrol oh. initiated. <laughs> Well, we made it. And I'm not... Timeline discrepancy detected nearby. Analysis. Ground appears to be scattered with purpleberry seedlings. This particular strain is of a variety proprietary to Rissos and should not be in common use.
timeline discrepancy detected. This console is 95% non-functional. Remaining 5% functionality stems from display reading, console non-functional. Cause of short out is most likely related to purple residue splattered all across the keyboard. Substance contains trace amounts of purple berries, fruit flavors, and artificial sweeteners number 35, number 49, number 240, number 322, number 314, and many, many, many others. Thank <laughs> you. 
wait, wait, wait. I'm supposed to say the slogan. Okay, you can do this, Anna. <clears throat> Here goes. It doesn't matter if you're you or me. We're all part of the Rizzo's family. How was that? It was, um, it was really, it rhymed. No jest? Well, that's a wager I sure would have lost. Guess even a busted spectrometer can be right if you hold it to the light, huh? I'm sure you've guessed it, but I'm not the best at remembering slogans. And when I can't remember them, I tend to just make them up. But I guess that's why I'm just an intern and not a full-timer. At least, not yet. What? No, that's ridiculous. I can't tell you I've never made any mistakes, but it'd be pretty hard to keep my job if I were trying to break everything. Though there was the time I tried to fix a broken hinge on one of our mosquito hives and released a swarm, chased me around the orchards three times before I managed to get help. Don't I know it. Worker friend of mine ran afoul of one of the swarms and had to get new kidneys. Not due to the renal failure, but because the mosquitoes kept stinging his kidneys. Don't worry though, mosquitoes are typically only about when living folks aren't in the orchards. I am contractually obligated to tell you that mosquitoes never get out during visiting hours. But when they do, the only way to get them to return is to go directly to hive control and activate emergency recall. Which isn't easy, considering all the hives near control. But this is all a departure from what I wanted to say. I've been trying to help the orchards, not harm them. Hold a moment. You haven't found anything, have you? Well, maybe. I might have had a supersized cup of mixed purpleberry punch and lemon slab that I might have knocked over when I was running routine diagnostics. Look, I know what you're thinking, but I have the proper permit to mix those drinks. I just left it in my other work uniform. This is why you should only ever carry one set of clothes. Hey, we have a lot of uniforms. It's hard keeping track of all your belongings. How did you notice? I... The diagnostic normally takes hours, and that's only if humidity's low. I wanted to take the initiative to try and make it faster. But there's nothing to come clean about. I've just been doing my best out here. Oh yes, I thought I saw someone who looked self-important enough to be her by the conservatory some time ago. Not to speak ill of the dead. I simply never liked the way she stole the limelight from the true star. Burbage 3001. I certainly am. That aerodynamic chassis? How the light glints off his rotund head? The way he enunciates, cry havoc and let loose the canons of war. Excuse me. I got a little lightheaded there. Nobody does Shakespeare like Burbage. What were we talking about? Who? I suppose so. I also suppose Helen won't be stealing the limelight ever again. It's not so different from being a regular worker, just with less pay and less respect. Oh, it's also more dangerous than traditional employment. You don't have the experience to back up your work yet, but being fired isn't any less threatening. Work-wise, I do a bit of everything. The orchards have been short-staffed as long as I've been working here. So if there's an odd job around, it usually gets passed to me. Much higher chance of promotion. If I can tough it out here without getting axed, I can skip the five plus years of customer service I'd normally have to deal with. I can prove my merit here and move up in the world. And the sooner I do that, the sooner I can set to improving things for everyone else.
Wow, that's some decidedly paranoid thinking. I can't imagine someone ever doing something that nasty. Much as I love delivering coffee and medical attention, not quite, no. Don't tell anyone I said this, but I sometimes feel that our workers could be treated a little better. Maybe only get electrocuted awake every other day? So I'm shooting for administration in Rizzo's. Maybe even the board itself. Best way to evoke change is from the inside, I think. Laws, you've got a sixth sense for finding the most embarrassing question, huh? My mother is the Rizzo's assistant vice president of flavor testing. She set me up with this position. Mostly to keep me from troubling her work, I think. Consequently, I don't always feel like I deserve to be here. All the more reason to work harder, I say. Happy to enlighten you on the fascinating world of internships. Let me know if there's anything I can help you with. Unless you already have, and I've forgotten. In which case, I probably won't forget a second time. Congratulations, Inspector. You've discovered more footprints belonging to the deceased actress known as Halcyon Helen. My last quarterly review said I had an attitude problem. Morale improvement program fixed me right up. I don't know how grateful I am to the morale improvement program. Changed my life. Timeline discrepancy detected nearby. Congratulations, Inspector. You've discovered more footprints belonging to the deceased actress known as Halcyon Helen. Timeline discrepancy detected nearby. Timeline discrepancy detected nearby. Timeline discrepancy detected nearby. Congratulations, Inspector. 
you've discovered more footprints belonging to the deceased actress known as Halcyon Helen. Hey, God! What are you doing in here? Are you authorized to be in the conservatory? Are you trying to give me a heart attack? Are you my ex-wife? No, she fell off the side of Eridanos under mysterious circumstances six years ago. Conveniently rendering our marriage contract null. You must be the new, uh, groundskeeper? Hmm, that can't be it either, seeing how the new one hasn't died yet. Just who are you? Merciful law, that sounds like a lot of philosophism, which is highly outlawed throughout Halcyon. But I won't report you, considering how heavily armed you are. Bleeding hell. Standing up like this makes a body forget how stiff it gets, bent over plants all day. Oh, seems I'm not as young as I feel. I sit inside, and I look at plants. Goal is usually to make Rizzo's fruit products hardier and sweeter, but for every success, there are a couple of hundred failures. Example, tried breeding native tripicale with a foreign strain. Would have called it hexticale. In the end, it bred so fast, workers were swallowed up before they could harvest it. That one, I think, can be attributed to the wasp -tidos. Some lament their irritability, but their productivity is unmatched. What's a few dead workers in the architect's designs? You say angry. I say efficient. Not only can our wasp kiddos defend themselves, but Rizzo's investments as well. They come through the orchards only during pollinization cycles, as dictated by our hive control operators, which means that visitors usually aren't on the receiving ends of their stingers. Well, yes, if there's an equipment malfunction, the pollinization cycle will have to be manually shut down, which means traveling to hive control while the wasp-kitos swarm. Indeed, tromped in and out of the conservatory with no heed for anyone else. Good thing none of my charges were damaged. Starlet or not, I would have had a harsh word for her. I heard she pushed her way into a tour of the RR and DD labs not soon after. She's just a serial actress, yet she acts like she's deserved of the same access as a co-CEO. Well, she's not going anywhere ever again, which is a shame, of course. Taken too soon and all. Oh, there that damn thing is. Thank you. I guess this proves it's wise to label your things. Otherwise, some fool might use them as prizes in an ill-advised scavenger hunt. I will admit, I did take the original, yes. But I did so to keep it away from those who shouldn't have it. It's safer in my hands. If you're here to get it, I might suggest you give up. I'm known to be quite a stubborn git. I didn't want it for anything. I needed to keep it safe. Rizzo's almost never makes mistakes, but offering a classified original product to the public for free? Any upstart might grab it and use it to make Rizzo's look bad, or, or steal it to make a new product offshoot, or, law forbid, start a lawsuit of some kind. 
better I hold on to it. The what now? I didn't order any mines or machines. I just paid Slug to encourage people not to enter the puzzle hedges. Figured they just dress somebody up like a primal and chase maze goers. Like we did after the Spectrum Black unveiling a decade back. Or maybe that was a real primal. I forget. Damnation. Hadn't thought of that. Isn't my having it better than any random guest making off with it? I guess not, if it'll cause the company more trouble. Here's the original. Don't do anything with it that I wouldn't do. discrepancy detected nearby. Analysis. This discarded canister is typical of the R-mounted storage tanks on the orchard's agricultural mechanicals. However, it is not currently attached to a mechanical. This canister contains a high amount of vinegar in addition to water. Warning. Use of vinegar, a known herbicide on purpleberry saplings, is a violation of Rizzo's agricultural standards. These canisters can typically be found in the nursery storage building in the Purpleberry Orchards, except for this one, which can be found here. Chemical makeup of substance, 50% water, 50% vinegar. Trace amounts of woolly cow feces also detected. Timeline discrepancy detected nearby. Congratulations, Inspector. You've discovered more footprints belonging to the deceased actress known as Halcyon Helen. Timeline discrepancy detected. Congratulations, Inspector. You've discovered more footprints belonging to the deceased actress known as Halcyon Helen. Congratulations, Inspector. You've discovered more footprints belonging to the deceased actress known as Halcyon. Timeline discrepancy. Congratulations, Inspector. You've discovered more footprints belonging to the deceased actress known as Halcyon Helen. Timeline discrepancy detected nearby. Congratulations, Inspector. You've discovered more footprints belonging to the deceased actress known as Halcyon. Timeline discrepancy. Congratulations, Inspector. You've discovered more footprints belonging to the deceased actress known as Halcyon Helen. 
Congratulations, Inspector. You've discovered more footprints belonging to the deceased actress known as Halcyon Helen. Congratulations, Inspector. You've discovered more footprints belonging to the deceased actress known as Halcyon Helen. Timeline discrepancy detected nearby. detected, embedded within the chunks of dark matter. Wicker is not a known ingredient of the dark matter product. The only members of a tossball team strong enough to crack a stick in two are the dedicated hackers, like Black Hole Birdie. Whatever Ms. Ruth Bellamy must have relayed to the Tossball hacker during their picnic together instigated a furious increase in his usual strength threshold by 52%. That's how breakups go some of the time. Or all of the time, for some of us. in awe before our huge Rizzo's Hothouse Conservatory trademark. This building hosts almost as many plant breeds as we have delicious products. <laughs> almost. Are you wondering about that omnipresent warm and fragrant mist? That's just our all-natural fertilizing spray made of pureed sissy pig waste products. From nature, back to nature. Our spray is part of the cycle of life. Note, Rizzo's discourages inhalation of its safe and natural liquid fertilizer. In case of accidental inhalation, please record any unusual effects and give that record to the nearest Rizzo's employee as quickly as possible. Remember, you are part of the Rizzo's family. Be kind to your family.
Hello again, youngster. You're certainly doing a lot of running to and fro. Don't overexert yourself. The wasp kiddos can smell weakness. Bleeding hell. Standing up like this makes a body. Back again, eh? I knew you couldn't resist my charms for long. Let me know if there's anything I can help you with. Unless you already have, and I've forgotten. In which case, I probably won't forget a second time. Why should weed killer affect saplings? Weed killer. It's in the name. It should kill only weeds. That really seems like it's more on product design than on me. But there's nothing to come clean about. I've just been doing my best out here. If you're keeping count, but I'm pretty sure every lab in this colony's got some horrible experiment going on. And yeah, I'm counting Doc Wells too.
caught a real lucky break working on Aridano. I could have been stuck on Terra too.